Equity Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Bungo Stray Dogs chapter 100.5. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. And we've hit code red levels of struggle up in yeah, We're talking everything from panic attack, migraine induced, and... Everything in a large freaking carton of goldfish levels of struggle up in here. Yeah, seriously, we're struggling to keep a roof over our heads. We're worried that me and Kitty will be living on the streets. It's really goddamn bad when I say code red struggle. Oh, I mean code red struggle. Oh, but if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, the Kitty, and channel alive and kicking, feel free to hit up our Cash Up and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So... Well, well, well. Uh, looks like Fukuchi got to Okra, but let's be real. Jiroko was going to probably side with Fukuchi to the ends of the earth, because she's just a stan. She is. So, no surprises there. But, Techo, you are still a fucking dumbass. You are a goddamn dumbass. Uh, because you had the comms open, and... My baby Kenji heard everything that was going down, and you already were being stupid because Kenji fucking offered to help you, and you were being such a stupid moron anyway. Well, Kenji heard what was going down, he's like, oh, no, Mr. Nice Guy from me, fuck, fuck you all, my bro needs me. I'm gonna just... I am going to stampede through you and just get to my bro. I I'm done playing with you, bro. <laughs> I'm done playing with you, dude. Oh, God. Kenji, I goddamn love you. You deserve the world. You did not deserve to deserve any of this shit. Nah. Anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this month. And this chapter is titled, In the Pier of the Sky Part 9, Second Half. I swear to God, I need a plushie of you, Kenji. I need a plushie of you so bad. I ain't being poor. <laughs> oh, you know what? Oh, Techo, <laughs> enjoy the car bar, Techo. Enjoy the car bar. The hunting dog before the wild bees. Yeah. <laughs> There's a reason why this manga is uh is selling so well. In Japan, yeah, if you watch my Oricon videos, which I do, uh, which I do every week, you know how well this manga is selling over in Japan. What? What do you do? Yes! Look at my boy! Kenji ain't playing no more! Must. Must help. Must help. Must help. Must help! Go save the pro! Must help. Must help. Techo, you could have had him help you, but nah, you had to be a fucking moron. Mm-hmm. Woo! The truck was instantly, what is this ability? It's called karma, bitch! That's what! <laughs> Don't kid me. Ooh, Kenji, you think Kenji fucking around with you, dude? Techo, you are fucking stupid. Oh my god. Kenji, please just whoop this fucker's ass. Please. Please send him all the way to the Delusion Theater. To the Delusion Drive-In Theater. It, that, and by the way, the Delusion Drive-In Theater, the business is popping over there. <laughs> Got a lot of new customers today. Oh, God, the delusion has been strong. The delusion and the projection has been fucking amazing. And there's been lots of fakery, too. But, oh, there was a new fakery that was open. Oh, God, yes, there was. But Techo, nah. Techo not running a fakery. Nah, that's Fukuchi. Fukuchi running, like, he running a, um, oh, my God, like a Costco-sized fakery. <laughs> He's running a fakery factory. He's like the fakery supplier. <laughs> that's a different kind of... That's... I'm not talking about Fukuchi, though. I just realized... <laughs> I just realized that. 
Oh God. Okay. What? Oh! Kenji! By the way, Kakita-san, when I went to work with Kenji Kun today during our investigation, a really fierce-looking man was uh, being unusually nice to Kenji Kun. Oh, I don't doubt it. Yokohama has an unwritten law. Never make Kenji angry. Never make Kenji angry. You won't like him when he's angry. Because, ha, huh, Bruce Banner eat your fucking heart out. You thought Bruce Banner was, was the Hulk. Nah, Kenji's a real fucking Hulk, bitch. <laughs> that, that general Kenji cut? Yes, you think it's peculiar, but really it's the reverse. Can you hear that? Maybe you're a real... Kitty, I wonder if you are like that. <laughs> kitty, you're so silly. Oh, my God. I wonder if this kitty has a little Hulk in him, too. A long time ago, there was a flood in a farming village in the Northeast. The terrible landslides that occurred every 50 years were so destructive that the maps had to be redrawn afterwards, but... The village was virtually unharmed. The director who had traveled there on an investigation at the time discovered why. Kitty, were you responsible for it? You did that, Keith! I got a little monster on my hands if he did this. I knew he was a powerful key, but geez, Seno. You were powerful keys. I underestimated you, cat. The director who traveled there on an investigation at the time discovered why. The reason why the village was unscathed was because during the flood, um, the mountain had crumbled just so that it had changed the direction of the floodwaters. Hi, Keith. Here, speaking of, here's the monster key. The foot of the mountain had disappeared as if a giant had torn it off. The one who did it, ah, it was my baby, was a boy in the village. Kenji had changed the shape of the mountain with his bare hands. His bare hands? His bare hands, his bare paws. Bare paws, right, Keith? His bare paws. Yeah, bare paws. Relax, Keys. Ah, now you being a fussy fuss. You came up here. You decided this. You consented to this, cat. But, hmm. Bruce Banner, you wish, you wish the Hulk Sarah probably came from Kenji. Right, kitties? There's my key. key. Good keys. During uh, the flood, his best friend, woo! During the flood, his best friend was buried alive. Kenji said he couldn't remember anything afterwards. Kenji's ability is the power of un unrestrained, raging nature. It's simply being contained by that mild demeanor. When danger, anger, or impending nightmares drive away, gentle Kenji, that that shows its face. The raging torrents of all heaven and earth, eruptions, tsunamis. But he can't have it stay angry constantly, which is why he usually substitutes its anger with the urgency of hunger. <laughs> He's a Saiyan! Kenji's a fucking Saiyan! Gotta wonder! Gotta wonder if that's why Saiyans are always fucking hungry! <laughs> That would explain, you know what? That explains, that would explain why Saiyans are hungry all the time. Because the raging torrents of all, um, of all heaven, or earth, the eruption tsunamis, but he can't have it stay angry constantly, which is usually, which is why he usually substitutes its anger with the urgency of hunger. Sounds a lot like a Saiyan. <laughs> Maybe Kenji is really a Saiyan. So if Kenji come over to really get angry, it's obvious. There, uh, is there a human on Earth that can stop eruptions with their own hands? Could Fukuchi stop it? I don't even know if his sword could stop. His sword may be able to stop it. His hack sword, but I don't know. Kill me. It should have chased justice. If I'd thought over it calmly, there's no way Juno would tell me abandon the case and come save me. For misunderstanding. Uh 
understanding my friend misreading justice, mistaking my enemy, this is the result. I have no right to be a hunting dog. Oh, now you realize this, you stupid fuck. Techo, you're stupid. Actually, you know what? Techo, you are dumb. You missed the fucking point. You got it half right. You should have thought calmly and, you know, maybe heard Kenji out. That maybe um, Kenji was telling the truth and he would have actually helped you, you stupid fucker. Oh my god. God, Tetro, you are dumb, dumb, dumb. You missed the point. Right, kitties? Because if he would have actually, if he would have listened to Kenji and heard him out and had, uh, you know, took Kenji's offer and helped, he would have gotten to the fucking bottom of it. But you're dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Do it. Let's go find that person together. See, thank you. <laughs> Thinking with a calm mind, there's no reason for me to be angry at you. Really? What about you? No. Before that, I've used too much power. I'll take a little break. Me too. I'm Techo. You are? I'm Kenji. Kenji. Knowing that name is today's largest gain. Wah! The storm has passed. Sleep for now. Wah! People are so fucking stubborn sometimes. I swear, it got to. It finally got to the point, though. It got to the. You got to the right. Po so, sometimes because people are stupid and they're not thinking smart, they're thinking with their heart. AKA you, Techow, because Kenji would have fucking helped you from the start. But you didn't listen, you stupid little shit. But we got there. Got there in the end. Could have been a fucking avoided. Good, look at look at this. Look at that. Hold on. Kenji could have killed his ass, but nah, he didn't. See, Kenji is like Goku in this way. He is. I'm telling you, this motherfucker is saying. He could have killed him, but he's like, no, I'm not going to kill him. So lift the pillar up, because his friend was crushed, too. Let's go find that person together. Thinking with a calm mind, there's no reason for me to be angry at you. Nah, there's more reason to be angry at the fucker that's going after his bro. Speaking of, what about sushi? Really? <laughs> I love that. I was like, what the fuck? Really? Yes, he said this from the start, you dumbass. What about you? No. Before that, I've used too much power. Let I'll take a little break. Me too. Yay! We got some yin yang wajib going. And yay! We got a new we got a new bro ship. I'm happy we got the bro ship. I I, I yeah. But like <laughs> But bro, Techo, you had to learn the hard way, didn't you, you stupid idiot? <laughs> Seriously. But I'm glad the only good thing that came out of this is knowing like what Kenji's power is. I know this there was a purpose for this, but God, Techo, you're a fucking idiot. You're a fucking douche. But I understand if you are under duress like But like even you know what, even if you're under duress like this, it's like Wait a minute, you're gonna help me find my bro? Good! And then you're gonna save this for when you found out that Fukuchi was being a little bitch. But, whatever. But what about sushi now? Because I thought that was the whole Fukuchi was gonna go after it's sushi. So what now? Part of me doesn't care. Part of me doesn't care. Because I'm happy with this. But the other part of me is, like, really confused. I'm very curious what you guys think. What do you guys think of this chapter? I really love Kenji's power. Like, Hulk, eat your fucking heart out. And also, like, seriously, Kenji is a goddamn Saiyan. He is a goddamn Saiyan. He's like Goku in that way. Right? Because this is like a Goku Piccolo movie. <laughs> Oh, God, this is something you would see like a Dragon Ball. Do not lie, you know it is true. 
But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What you guys thought of this chapter. What do you guys think of Kenji's power? Is it giving you very Hulk realness? Um, and, like, yeah, we got there in the end, but god damn, like, Techo, you fucking... <sighs> At least we got there. Hopefully they're not going to be arrested for too long, because uh, we kind of need them. But it'll be interesting to when we get to Fukuchi. It will. I don't know if Kenji's power going to be enough to stop Fukuchi, though. Mm-mm. Because -mm. Fukuchi's fakery is getting, uh, is on a new level of, of, uh, business. Ugh, it's a supplier, let's be fucking real. It's a worldwide supplier of fake, uh, fakery. What do you think, like, Sagawa from A Couple of Cuckoos and Mommy from Kanojo Okarashimasu is getting all their, uh, vegan and, um, uh, vegan and gluten-free goods from? Yep. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc. Love what I'm doing. I want to help keep this channel alive. Uh, and kicking and also this little kitty alive and kicking the Hulk kitty. The Hulk it is! <laughs> so we can keep bringing you more Bungo um, Stray Dogs content. Well, Bungo Stray Kitties content. Right, Kitty? You are Bungo Stray Kitty, right? Like, yes, I'm a Bungo Stray Kitty. Fear me, right, Keys? They should fear you, right, Key? Yeah, see, look at that! He knows! You ways you can do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.